Hi, y'all, it's me and Rudo. We're back here with Fire Emblem Three Houses, doing our Azure Moon Maddening run. I'm recording this right after I, I finished recording the last one. We are picking up right after uh, we just took out the Costas, the leader of the bandits that were local. I figure we have a whole month ahead of us in game, so we're not going to get to the next story mission this time. We're mostly going to fake fo uh, fake us. focus on uh, building our characters up. Some of them are even level five at this point. I think maybe probably just Dimitri and I, so we'll be able to class up now, which is good. And the other ones are not far behind. They're getting much more in tune with their abilities, and as we... Uh, uh, do more lessons, they'll get to actually have spells for the spellcasters and weapon proclivity for the uh, weapon attackers. So that'll be great, but for now we have to stare ominously into these ruins. I remember this being a peaceful place. So this agrees. Hmm. 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 I wonder why it is that you recall this place. Yeah, They speak again! <laughs> Each time I speak, it scares you so. I'm very weak of heart. I just had a harrowing encounter with bandits where I totally got wrecked. I'm sorry. Although the battle's at an end, do not feel too at ease. I don't. You just scared the bejesus out of me. I am quite fascinated by this place. As am I. We should be back here at some point to get a certain relic. Relic. Have you been here before, Sothis? Here? I dare say it would be impossible to have forgotten such a place as this. And yet you seem so familiar with it a second ago. <laughs> I am unsure. Beyond the name and the strange feeling of familiarity, I can't seem to remember anything about this place. I remember that I like to leave as soon as I get here, usually. The emotions tied to that sense of familiarity. Like joy and sorrow, pain and love, and all things in between. Well, that's just vague enough to mean nothing. <laughs> so this... <laughs> You probably don't want to know the answer to that. We should return to the monastery soon. We're all ready for the journey. Ready enough. I I, I hope so, because you all took Let's quite a beating in that battle me. because of me. I'm sorry about it. But know that time reveals all things. One day I will remember that which I have lost. It's quite a bit of confidence. Oh, by the way, it seems you've mm -hmm. earned my gratitude. The thieves who came here are no more. <laughs> wow, you, you just realized that you're like, hey, <laughs> wow, how about that? Thanks. Why are you, or why are you grateful? <laughs> Let me not trail off. Why are you grateful? Grateful all the same. Probably because of your connection to this place. You didn't like seeing the thieves in, the, in here. You must become accustomed to my voice. I am. You fall down with shock <laughs> Enough. I speak. That just won't do. No, it'll probably be bad, won't it? Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> of course you are. It was a jest. No, I'm not. I've been getting this crap scared of me every time. But thank you for saying so. <laughs> it's rather polite, and I feel like I probably didn't do anything to deserve it. Ah, yeah, after that long excursion. It was probably only a few days, given that we're only at the start of next month. Yes, well, as the professor, it is my job. <laughs> Thanks, Dimitri. Edelgard. Oh, is she here? Does the Black Hi. Eagle House have a mission to see to? Remember, on a real battlefield, one can never tell what's to come. All right, there's no need to admonish her. She's way stronger than both of us. <laughs> the possibility of the worst case scenario. Take care, Edelgard. Oh, he's just there's worried. No I get to it. State the obvious, Dimitri. But tell me, why the concern? Ouch. Perhaps you doubt my abilities? So, no, like that's not it. <laughs> Just recalling when I got an axe last time. That's not what I meant. If I've offended you, I hope you'll accept my apology. Oh, I love Dimitri. <laughs> he's just—he's just, he's just every time he's, someone's like, Everyone's like waiting. even slightly snaps at him. He's just like, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. <laughs> I didn't realize what I said. All right. I Thanks, little guard. Be off too. Try not to let her get to you, Dimitri. I promise you, there's no need for concern. She's going through some stuff. <laughs> don't worry about it. Puppy love? No, I don't want to be an asshole. Why are you so worried? I'll tell you all about it. Some other time. Alright, that works with me. You've got all the time in the world, which is two hours and 46 minutes left on this camera, which I'll probably not run out, so hopefully. So have <laughs> disposed of those bandits. Phew! I pray that their souls find salvation. Same here. But why did they target the students to begin with? A good question. <laughs> we must further investigate the true cause of all that took place. I assume you're referring to, uh, in the woods when they, they attacked them? I mean, probably just because they thought they had lots of money, because it's a very expensive-looking garb. Know, I ask that you support the students and relieve them of any unnecessary worry. What about my unnecessary worry? What if I am unnecessarily worried? <laughs> and I somehow translate that to them by accident. I will do all that I can. Good. I have high expectations for you. You shouldn't. By the way, <laughs> but thanks. How was your time in Xanadu? Weird and nostalgic. In ancient times, a goddess alighted upon this world in that very canyon. Ah, well, that explains it. Goddess from the heavens, Xanadu could only have been a temporary haven. 
I see. A temporary haven. Long ago, the divine Seros received a revelation from the goddess. Is this what Xando used to look to like? Dang. Rest. It's real cool. Actually, I never noticed this. This is a really cool landscape shot. It almost looks like photorealistic. It might even be in the background there. That's dope. The goddess is always watching over Fodland from her kingdom above. However, in ancient times, the goddess graced this world with her presence and all salvation to the people. <laughs> she stopped doing it when uh, nothing happened. Arbiter, Don't worry about it. <laughs> the arbiter of every soul. All right, man, you're a big fan of it being religious and all. Uh, that seems a bit point acu acu accusational towards Gerald. I didn't know. It's probably a better, I more see. polite thing to say. Oh, man. Your time here, I, I guess she wasn't very happy that uh, Gerald hadn't told me anything about it. Uh, Lady Rhea, I am sorry to interrupt. No problem, we weren't talking about anything important, just God. In regard to those bandits. Yes? Oh, is this not we for me? Our when next we meet. All right, bye. A goddess? <laughs> you don't even know what the color red is. Actually, probably after Red Canyon you do. Yes, you can't remember, but you did know at some point. I understand this. That that must be it. I don't know. No, that cannot be. I am most certainly alive. Enough. Yeah, anyways. Of course, we also have the mystery of here with you. Is it somehow connected? I think it's very strange that it only, you only just recently started talking to me. Perhaps but yes. Past regret is stopping me from moving on, and now I'm forced to stay with you instead. It's a little more clinical than no, that, actually. That's not it. <laughs> I can't believe in such a meaningless existence. I. Uh... <sighs> Should probably take a nap. Yes. <laughs> All right, good night. You don't have to make the bed in my head. It's fine. You can just sort of leave it in disarray. That's what I usually do. My head is always a mess. Almost as messy as my room. I am thankful you cannot see the rest of this with the camera. Oh, I mean, guess you can see a bit over there. White clouds. Maybe. Garland moon. Mutiny in the mist. This is actually slightly a, a slightly tough mission, so I'm a little worried about not being strong enough when we come to this one, but we'll have lots of, of training time in between. We'd have way more if I had a higher professor level. I should really do like buying lots of like um, bait and all kind every opportunity I can use to, to get that up. Young women hurry to pick the last of the white roses. Free buds are woven in I'd be picking them too. <laughs> oh, this art is so dope as well. Very un Fire Emblem, this. It's almost like a... I want to say it looks like Celtic or something. And Fire Emblem doesn't... I wouldn't say usually take from Celtic lore as much as other lores. <laughs> a, lot, a lot more to do with Greek and stuff, I would usually think. Or maybe... No, well, I guess I'm not, I, don't know, I don't know that exactly. There are new places to explore in the monastery and I got more money. Sweet! Everything is going is turning up Byleth. Oh, it's unfortunate we don't get to teach on the first Sunday. For your Not so. We have received reports that Lord Lonato has rallied troops against the Holy Church of Saints. Hey, isn't that Ash's dad? <laughs> Why would he do that? Lord Lonato is a minor lord of the kingdom. He has been showing hostility toward the church for some time now. Ah. A vanguard unit from the Knights of Saints. And what did you do to, to quell that hostility? To Said some nice things, I hope. Invited them to tea. Lord Lonato's army is nothing compared to the Knights. It is quite possible the rebellion has already been suppressed. But in the unlikely, very not going to happen event that it doesn't, you want me to be there. I see. War zones are unpredictable. We do not expect you will have cause to battle, but be prepared for the worst. As always. Excuse me. You sent for me, Lady Rhea? Are you the, the head of the Knights Cap Guild she that we'll be, be taking with? Yes, I already know the answer to that question, so I asked it wrong anyways. <laughs> Thanks for the introduction, Rhea. Nice to meet you. We've heard a lot about and hi you, my friend. You and your wicked fast. sword. She is one of our bravest knights. And that is no small feat. Ho ho. Only an exception. Gerald's there too. <laughs> to join the Knights of Seros. This mission should prove useful in demonstrating to the students how foolish it would be to ever turn their blades on. Ah, the threatening people. That's good. <laughs> threatening people by literally showing other people dying. This is even better, really. Whose birthday is coming up? Too bad I don't get to teach here. I only get three teaching sessions this month. It's better than last month, anyways. Sylvain! My boy! No problem. Happy birthday, guy. You know about Sylvain is a lot of people... Ooh, 
bit of Gary Sanders. A lot of people find him to be like a bit of a, uh, a creep, and I understand. He is way too much, way too often. But he's not, he's not like, he's not like pushy creepy. Like he, he's just, he's just flirty in the sense of like, he fancies himself a romantic, I guess. And, and I mean, like it's more depth complicated than that. It watches all his supports and everything. But like, there's, he, it's like, if, if anyone tells him like, just, just give, just stop, man, and like back off. He usually is like, oh, oh shit, I'm sorry, and, and like goes away, which is more than can be said for certain other characters in the cast. So I, I don't uh, find him to be as like problematic. I mean, he has other problematic things about him, but he's on a journey. They're all on a journey. And speaking of journeys, let's watch their support. Oh, Ash, for support of again. The run. You're taking this whole night thing pretty seriously. I love them so it's much. Just my daily training. Maybe you could stand to be a little more eager yourself. If I want to be maybe Sylvain. I mean, you're, I know you're already very good at everything, but. <laughs> No choice. I think you're making life too difficult. Knights don't have to be perfect. All I'm saying is I am a bit I've of a, a Sylvanian type. Out there. <laughs> In That's that regard. Going to be me. I'm going to be a proud knight. I, I don't always Virtuous work as hard as I ought to, but Virtuous I think I have more of Ash's disposition about me? work, if I'd say. Ride around being yes, that was a little cliche what you just said, Ash. <laughs> They'll boot you out of town. It's never wrong to have virtue. Naughty means being made an outcast. But you can pair it with your charisma. You think very highly of this whole virtue thing. Say, have there been any knights who became great just by thinking highly of themselves? Well, he didn't say he was thinking highly of himself. He said he thought highly of the idea of virtue, think which means this. making himself better. Knights are supposed to protect people and earn their admiration. Isn't that right? Well, you can argue yes. that's a form of virtue. So what are you saying I should do? Seize people's hearts. What do you mean? <laughs> He's taking a roundabout way of, of trying to get you to his mindset. That is. It's you, Ash. They don't have you. Get out there, But he is also kind of right. Be valiant. Help people. Here. I'll show you how it works. Uh, so I'm sure you will. Don't go bothering people. <laughs> hey there, no, cutie. don't. I just want to talk. <laughs> they must be heavy. My name's Sylvain. Let me help you out. Are these going in the warehouse? Helping out those in need. <laughs> I guess that's a good start. I love how Ash is just sort of taking this in from the side, just like a value. Okay, no, okay, maybe this could while Sylvain's running around just, just, just making a fool of himself. To well, if you insist, how about we go get some tea? It must be fate. So Ash is gonna put a stop to this. I'd like to get to know you. Great night, huh? More like a great philanderer. <laughs> Seems like he can be both, probably. Flirt with women. No well, helping them though, so. I have to stop. <laughs> All right, Ash. Virtue away. Oh, that's sweet. I do like what Sylvain says there. He's like, like you know, it's, it's, there's no point in being a good knight if you're just gonna, like, be all all aloof and uh, off there talking about how valiant you are. Just go out there and help people. Look out for the little one, as it were. So I do kind of want to explore to get people's motivations up for the, um, that's not how you check their motivations. Where do their motivations show up, actually? Goals, probably. Yes, um, I want to get people's motivations up for the next time we get to teach. I can only do that and explore, and that's also when I can raise my professor level and go harvest all the seeds and stuff. There's a lot of things that I want to do with Explore. But battle also, we do need to do a lot of those. We have th four free days, okay. So we can do this. All right, certifications. Let's do that before anything else, shall we? So if I'm gonna want to be a Wyvern Lord, probably my path is gonna be I'm gonna want to start as fighter. We don't have a great chance of passing that, so I can start working on my axing. I guess I could either go to Brigand for even more axe, or I could go to Pegasus Knight to start getting good at flying. Although you need lance work for that, so that and it's gotta be C, so that's... God, I'm not practicing lances just for that. So I'm probably gonna go to just to Brigand next then, and then to Wyvern Lord at level 20. Or no, it's only Wyvern Rider here, and then when you get to Master, it's Wyvern Lord. Same deal, really. And then for you, oh wait, is there not Archer here? Oh no, right, Fighter, because Fighter kind of, you, you, Bow is one of the things you're allowed to have. It only tests one of these skills here, right, right, right. So you can, you can start at, f Fighter is what you want to be first, and then you get to be Archer at level 10, which is even better, more specifically to Bow stuff. But we should be able to be able to do that. I might not necessarily pass my, my Fighter's exam, which is fine, because we can take it next week. Because I'm not going to be doing any fighting this turn anyways, and I might be able to get my axe up in between then. So anyways, let's give it a try. First exam of the whole game, and it's me taking it, and I have no idea what I'm doing apparently. Let's see how that went. It worked! I get shoulder pads now! A new path to tread. Yes, I want to change into this class. Oh, uh, wait, I did get my, my HP plus 5, didn't I? Yes, I did. Okay, good. And Dimitri, you have a 100% chance of passing your fighter exam, so go for it. I fully... You did it! Who would have thought that? Nicely done. This outfit is not look amazing on you. As good as your your student <laughs> uniform anyways. But I, 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 that's not a comment on your figure or anything. I wasn't trying to be an asshole like that. Alright, so when we get Felix up here, we're going to want to turn him to Myrmidon. 
so that he can then go to... Well, I mean, at some point he's going to be Dancer when the game lets us do that, but we could, we're just going to class him into swords until that happens. Or, oh wait, should we... No, wait, maybe we should... Should we class him into a mage so he can work on his mage stuff while still having a sword? Is that better? I'm not sure. Ash, we're going to want to class into mage... Or monk. Ditto for Sylvain and Ingrid. Mercy, we're going to want to do fighter as well. And then Annette as well. So we're going to have a lot of fighters in our party, actually. It's going to be kind of wild. All for most, mostly for different weapons and, and, and objectives, though. For the time being, they'll all be start as fighters. Okay, I think I want to do my exploring first so we can get up as much of that motivation as possible. For this. We won't be able to get up tons and tons, though. I think we might want to just have two meals. Ah, but there are quests to do first. Bolstering forces. Is, is your battalion strong enough? I don't know, Yuritsa. Is it? Let's go see where Yuritsa's at. Hey there, he's still by the pond. I desired fresh air. And also to speak with me, I heard. The wind feels nice. You don't think so? <laughs> Alright. There is solitude on the battlefield. But there are limits to what one can achieve alone. To be stronger, more efficient, visit the battalion guild. I can do that! I will do that right away, in fact. No, I will not do that right away. Let me do some quests first before I go buying all this stuff, because we get rewards from quests. There may be things I don't end up having to buy, or I don't want to buy as much, and stuff like that. What are you wondering about there, Mercy? Lord Lenato? They say he's a very kind and gentle lord. I've heard that from Ash. Why would such a kind man suddenly raise an army? Trickery going on, I tell you. You were working late last night, weren't you? Yes. You shouldn't overdo I was playing lots of Fire Emblem Three Houses for the Nintendo Switch. Well to get you if you stay up too late. That's terrifying. I can't believe you would tell me that. I will never sleep again. What's your quest? Those who struggle with private concerns will sometimes visit the cathedral for guidance. If you have the time, why not offer your keen insight, Professor? Well, it's very kind of you to say keen, and also a bit of an exaggeration, but I will do that, sure. Going on a mission with the knights, right? That's right. I wonder if... Oh, sorry, it's mm -hmm. nothing. I was just wondering if someone I've been searching for might be among them. You refer to the person with the same hair color and always looking grim that you were referring to before, aren't you? I hope you find whomever you're looking Thank for. You. I'm definitely gonna find him one of these days. I believe in you. Definitely, 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 definitely. For sure, for sureness. Who's staying out here? Sylvain! What's going on, my dude? Where's Felix? That's that's just what you're thinking at every all at moment of every day, isn't it? Professor, have you seen Felix around? I swear, as soon as you take your eyes off him, poof, he's gone. It's true. He was probably at the train. I saw him at the training ground. Uh, of course he's there. Sorry for bothering you, Professor. Thanks. No problem. You do whatever you need to do there. I don't really know where I was going with that. All right, so we could go to that quest in the, the, the marketplace now. There was also one... Oh, right, because uh, Mercy just asked us to go to the, the reception box. This is a good way, because this is completely free, and you can do it. And as long as you do it right, you help people. I think even if you do it wrong, doesn't it help a little? I can't remember. Would you like to read a note from the advice box? Yes, I would. Uh, okay, this is Ash. I'd like to borrow a book from the library, but there are so many to choose from that I can't decide. Do you have any recommendations? Um, the History of the Founding of Fargus, A Sword of Kaifun, Lug and the Maiden of Wind. He loves Lug books, doesn't he? No! Oh, maybe he's read that one already. Maybe I should have sent Kaifun in the... Uh, he doesn't like history stuff, I don't think. Resolving other people's problems is difficult. You may be able to figure out what they're seeking if you become close enough to spend time alone with them. I will take your advice to heart. <laughs> Ooh, you gave me bait. Thank you very much, Mercy. Just found five snails to give me. I mean, seeing, knowing Byleth, Byleth would probably be like, argh, argh. So I guess that's a reasonable thing to want. Oh, hi there, Ash. I'm sorry I didn't help your trouble. Please, Professor, there must be some mistake. Lenato would never raise arms against the church. I don't make the rules. I'm sorry. You never said anything to me about it. I know this is a terrible time because Ash is going through some hardship, but I love the lighting on their hair in this game. I just love the way that's drawn like that. Oh, Ash, oh boy. We're going to get through this together, I promise. Things are going to be okay. I'm very sorry for what you're going through, though. Um, where is, uh, wait, is there anything else I want to do in here? No. There are a few quests going on on the second floor here, though. Is that Geralt in his room? Or no, is that Henneman, maybe? I forget whose room that is. Well. Just down here. Oh, sorry for running into your chest. Oh, hey, is that a lost item here? What is this? A sketch of a sigil. A drawing of a circle I use to activate magic. It's probably belongs to someone interested in magic and quests. I wonder. Wait, this is not Hanuman's room. Wait, Hanuman's not even here. I know I just said his name two different ways. Hi, <laughs> Manuela. What is so utterly awful? Did you hear? There's news of someone in the kingdom oh. raising an army. Yeah, that's real awful. The, kingdom, the empire, the alliance. They do love a good war, don't they? You can't even stop them at some point. Of young men and women. And for what? 
just to enjoy the horror of it? One imagines. Would you Oof. be so kind as to do me a favor? I would, right after I read the description. It's extremely important that professors tend to their own studies as well. If you agree, I'd be more than happy to share my knowledge. Sure, I don't know exactly what that... Oh, faculty training. Right, 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 right. I can do this to raise my own stats and things. Ooh, I could raise my own thing and thing. I'm, I'm not going to... Oh, I can't back out of it. Bugger. Um, okay, well, I don't need this because I'm going to be a uh, wyvern lord, so I won't be able to do magic. So I'll start on the flying. That's good. I must thank you, Professor. Well, thank you for teaching me, even though it took one of my points that I could have used for food. I should have not done that yet. It's fun to learn like this, even as adults. How about we get others to join up as well? I'm sure they'll be elated to participate. D uh, d sure, but I mean, only the teachers. <laughs> I think it's safe to say. All oh, right, and who's over here? Is Hanuman maybe over here? Not in the cardinal room, cardinal room, but just south of it, with this little like armory room they have here. What is this room? Common room. Oh, okay. Oh no, it's Gerald. Hey, what's going on? Castle Gaspar, eh? Mm -hmm. I've been there once before, many years ago. I bet it was you the have. Quest of the son of that family, Kristoff, I think it was. And what were you doing there, by chance? Well, never mind. We don't need to know about that. Well, I could have you faculty to shame me as well, but I need to very much get I the motivation up. Hey, seems I've lost something. When you have a minute, can you help me look for it? Sure. I mean, it'll be difficult without any idea of what it could be, but I already know where it is anyway, because it glows up on the map. Most people's don't, but yours does for this quest. I'll get your flask for you. You'll be able to resume your heavy drinking in a minute. Don't you worry, Paul. Flask that gives off a strong alcoholic smell. I love <laughs> Geralt and alcoholic smell, uh, smell are, uh, are both <laughs> highlighted, as though they just str specifically want to link those two ideas very strongly. Do 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 do. Here you go. That was helpful. Feels good, doesn't it? If you come across any more lost items, be sure to find their owner right away. I'll do what I can. Ooh, wooden. Oh, I gave wooden flask. I was like, he gave me a flask. <laughs> uh, all right, where, where the hell is Hanneman? Is he around here? He's not. Where the hell is this man? Oh, he's in the he's in the the dining hall. Cool. Hello, yeah. Oh, here's Seth. What's going on? A moment, I would like a word. Sure. It has been brought to my attention that certain individuals have been making advances toward flame. Does this have anything to do with one of my have students? Have you witnessed any such behavior? I have not, but I will tell you when I do. Not at all. If you see anything similar in the future, please inform the perpetrators of their peril. <laughs> okay, I will do that. Oh, the way he said that was so funny. <laughs> please inform the perpetrators of their peril. <laughs> I picture if there was, like, more advanced facial animation, it would have, like, zoomed in on his face and he would have, like, glowered his eyes a bit. Oh, that was great. Where is Annie? I bet that sor School of Sorcery book belongs to her, because that's where she went to school, is it not? Where is my girl? She is not anywhere. She does not exist in this game anymore. They patched her out. Oh, no, right. She was in the reception hall. I was just talking to her. <laughs> Jokes. Annie! I found a thing! But, oh, that's not a, it's not a gift. It is not that. Oh, right. Gifts are a really easy way to raise people's motivation. I should give lots of people that. Is this yours? Good. No how problem. You know it was mine? Cause you're one of the few people who went to the school of sorcery. That's how. And do you want to? Uh, hmm, wait. Maybe. Are you into cute things? I kind of forget. I should probably spend this on more better on people who actually. I definitely like these things. Mercy likes cute things. What's your motivation at? Actually, can I check it here? Ooh, you definitely like cute things, right? Oh my, there you go. It's your cute little stuffy. Uh, you probably aren't as big on these things. All right, let's go see about getting that guild, uh, that, uh, sorry, that guild master of the battalions. Let's go see about getting a battalion is what I meant to say. Hi there, Hilda. Professor. Hi. Professor, your clothes are a bit dirty. Yeah, I was traveling them. I don't have a change. I'm a merc. I'd have expected you to be more careful, seeing as how you're a professor and all. I'm not very careful. when my clothes get dirty. That's one of the many reasons I find it best to train as little as possible. Ah, great. I'll just avoid telling Hanuman you said that, I guess. Oh, I can recruit her? Oh, yeah, you can. Right, that's so cool. I kind of do want to recruit her because Hilda's just awesome. But oh, why am I giving you gifts? You're not in my party. Bye. <laughs> Where's the guildmaster again? Right down here. Silly question. It's marked on the map and everything. What do I require? Let me tell you. I want to hire some battalions uh, just for the barracks. Ooh, because there are some real good ones. I want the one with stride for sure. Sure thing, thanks. What are some other ones I want? Uh, I want more ones with uh, four length um, ones. So the Kingdom Knights, that's a good one. Your money's worth. Will I now? Really, I should be hiring, hiring lots of them. Ooh, cold ice, ice magic, sweet. Does it like freeze people or whatever? I guess not. Not that I have lots of money to do tons and tons. And this is just a healing thing, so that's 
kind of cool, but I can't see myself like throwing a, um, a mage into the into an arena where there are six people lined up like that. So I don't feel like I will use that very much. Some of the ranged ones are not always bad, especially do we have one a ranged one that's with arrows? What's it called? Nah. Too bad. Those battalions will be good for now, though. We don't want to spend too much money on them anyways, because we don't have very much money. You went to the battalion guild. Track how your battalion and those of others are faring. Although solitude is the true battle. Thanks for your insight, Charitza. It's very sweet, I think. That right. There are even some that aren't affiliated with the Church of Seros. Including the kingdom ones that I just bought, right? You should visit the guild soon and come to your own conclusions. All right. Battalions will lose endurance. When that happens, you can replenish their endurance by visiting the Battalion Guild in the market. Ah, in fact, I should do that now, anyways. It's weird, I don't remember that being having being a thing that was narrated by one of the characters. Oh, wait, no, let's just do them all. Yes, please, thank you. I'm glad that I let you do them all and not one at a time. They don't make you do it one at a time. Ooh, some tea, and is this someone's lost item? Oh, no, just a fish. Someone just left lying around. That's probably mine, even though it's at a storefront. All right, I probably don't need any new weapons. Oh, we got more supports. Oh, it's me and Annie. We should definitely do that. Actually, can I do that right now? <gasps> I can. Any. <laughs> Hello. I'm very normal. Oh wait, I didn't. I wasn't meeting her. I was just seeing the knights hall. <laughs> I wasted all that hissing and, and groaning for no reason. Ah, and the stable. How peaceful. Now where was I? Any. Hi. You want to talk to me? I want to talk to you. Hi. Hi. Yes. Let's do that now. Do you have a moment? For you, always. Um, uh, of course. Well, I have this book of battle tactics that I borrowed I'm from sorry, this game brings out a bad thing in me. There's one yes? that I just don't understand. Do you think you could explain it to me? Probably off camera I could. I'm not sure. <laughs> That's kind of, kind of mean. Leave it to me. Great. Thank you so much. It's about this diagram here. I don't get why the knights are grouping up in that forest there. I just can't see the advantage to a formation like that. Well, you see, it increases your avoidance by 20% and gives you plus one to defense. Yay, I finally get it! <laughs> I explained it. <laughs> Thank you. You're the one who did the work. No way. I couldn't have done it without Don't you. lie to me. <laughs> <laughs> I just love learning you. As evidenced. That's why I came to the You, you took that new lesson in stride very well. Magic, battle tactics, martial arts, and, and, well... All kinds of and you will learn all three. Of, actually, I guess you won't be learning as much magic. You already know some magic. Now than I have in my whole entire life. That's because you're an of, incredibly I've powerful person in many ways. Practice, which is just before sword training. Mm -hmm. Don't overdo it. That's just not possible. I always find it's more tiring to laze around doing nothing. I understand your thought process there. I have to have something to do. Like on my days off, I need to get up early and take care of the cleaning first, or I just can't relax. You know what I it mean? does kind of stack up. I do know the feeling, although I wouldn't say it's something all over me, so I can't say I don't know the feeling. I know the feeling. Oh, I'm so glad you agree. You'd be surprised how rare it is to find people like us. <laughs> I don't think you can group us together. You're kind of up here and I'm over here. I don't get that girl sometimes. Not to mention. Well, she's a different oh, no. breed of everything altogether. I was What's that? To be on cooking duty today. Ugh, I completely forgot. It's okay. We can go there together and Okay. Okay, bye. Put this stupid barrel here. That was me. I apologize. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. And so for as reward for our sea support, I broke Annette's ankle. I'm the worst teacher. Felix is hanging around here, probably watching. Uh, I haven't been there. Oh, I still have one point. I, I should use. Ooh. Mm, er, uh, no, I'm gonna use that on on meal because I do want to. Um, ooh, sweet tooth week. Annie's gonna love that. Although she's already at max thing with me. Where are all other people? Okay, they're not as hype about sweets, but they'll they'll like enjoy it a bit. Sure. We want to. I do want Sylvain up because I want my healers to be. I want to teach. Actually, I kind of also want Ingrid. So maybe I won't do Mercedes because uh, she'll learn it. Axes. She'll she'll get the hang of it. But I do need Ingrid to get her magic real fast. Peach sorbet. Who could say no to a peach sorbet? I mean, obviously, all the people at the bottom of the menu, but anyways. Sylvain and Ingrid, how you doing, guys? After I got to the monastery, nobody in Fargus knows how to cook. That's okay, I don't either. It's wonderful to be able to eat a nice meal every day. It is nice. It's. I'm glad that, that the monastery allows for that. Ooh, and my teach level went up. Ooh, and, and Mercy gave me all those 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 snails, so I should be able to go do fishing. I might even be able to get my, my um level up even higher, but before I do that, I should probably harvest those seeds that I got and try and plant some more. 
Hi, Perpetra. This flower is one that is eating insects. Yeah. Is that factual too? I mean, you saw it. <laughs> I'm wondering who watches over the plants in Fodland. Not I, that's for sure. I don't know a damn thing. I'm gonna go get some plants. <laughs> some f uh, vegetables and seeds. Good, good, good. None of these are more than one star, so that's not excellent. Let's throw some root vegetable seeds in there now that we've got tons of them. Sure. And pour some water. The f crops are doing a little better now than they were before. Hi there, Flane. If the flowers within the greenhouse are removed, they will soon wilt and wither. Well, some of them. Is that not so, Professor? I'm not the right person to ask. <laughs> ask Ash, he knows about that stuff. Flowers. Flowers oh. that thrive, despite their environment, are truly inspiring. Are they not? I would say so. And you have a way of making everything either really poetic and, and awesome, or really dorky, or really sad. One of the three. And it's always impressive. It's just why you're you're a pro gamer, Flame. Uh, okay, how much bait do I have? It's just the snails. Okay, let's do it. Let's go hard fishing all day, every day, but like just right now. <laughs> let's do it. Fish, 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 fish. We got a new fish. I know this raises your professor level, but I don't believe, um... Yay! This is dope. Now let's try and pass that blue one up. We'll head for some... Get out of here. Get out of here, let's get some better. Yeah! I mean, there's the third one, so we had to take it, but yeah. It's a small fish, but yeah. <laughs> just just be excited about the little things, and your whole life will be better, I promise. Yank! It was a Caledonian gray fish, I believe. I didn't read it, though, because I was just mashing. Because I gotta get out of the way and get onto some fights here, so we can get a little strong. Okay, that's a bigger fish. But let's wait for another red one, or even a yellow one, shall we? Not that. That's not red or yellow. Hey, at least it wasn't a tiny one this time. Gotta look on the bright side of life. <laughs> That's a Monty Python joke. I'll take a red one. We take red ones here. We do take the red ones. Blue. A fish. And uh, another fish. Let's do that one. There we go. All right. Now that I've learned how to teach better from wrangling a bit, we can leave. Marvelous. Um, and we don't have any more points to spend. We could go around talking to some more people if we want. And I do want, but I don't want to edit more two-hour videos. So I might just leave these people. Even though, uh, the thing is, this game does have, there are a lot of cool things. I mean, I think most of the best dialogue is in the supports, I tend to think. Like, that's where most of the meaningful stuff is in, in, in this, the main story. But these dialogues that go on in the, in the, tr in the uh, monastery are, are not unimportant by any means. But to talk to everyone, it would take me like a whole hour right now from where we are. And so I would, I would be like way near the end of this episode before I even got into the next uh, fight. So I will just have to not talk to some people. That's all right though. Oh, um, is there anything else I can... No, there's nothing else I, I would need to do before leaving here. Because the only thing I would want to spend today are my professor points and I've done that already. So time to go. All right, time to teach. I am um, going to start with Ash and Sylvain, I think. Or his Ash's... Right, no, Ash's thing is all the way up. And so is Sylvain. Even though Ingrid is lagging behind a bit more than them in terms of uh, their progress with healing. So I definitely, I just definitely want them, or actually, no, maybe I'll do Sylvain. Oh no, I get four now. Oh, that's great. So I can do all three of them and then another person. So I guess it'll be either Annie or Felix. And Felix, he can already be using swords, so he can just continue with swords and he'll be growing in his magic as well. So I'll probably do Annette because she grows sort of slowly in armor. Um, so let's actually start by doing that. Let's just get, go another day of all armor. You can do it, Annie. No problem. Time. My time is all yours anytime, partner. You did a very good at lifting that armor. So as a Grimmery or Mortal Savant, regardless of what I'm making her, she can still use white magic, can't she? So I suppose I should have her training a little in it. But we can deal with that later, because we'll have other healers, but right now we need- we definitely want her to start out having good magic attack. Does she have a weakness into this or anything? No, she doesn't. Do, are there any things she's weak to? No, she's just good- damn. <laughs> she's just really good. Thanks, Ingrid. I appreciate you. Alright, and now we want Ash and Sylvain. We're just gonna go all in on, um, magic, I think. Yeah. I mean, we will want Lance and Riding for them later, but I just want to get this healing started so that they can start out as good healers, and then we can work on how they're going to get around healing later. <laughs> you're making me blush. Oh, you, you're making me blush, and then we're all blushing, and it's just a fun old rom com time down here in the monastery. All right. No, no, enough of that. Let's teach. You're going to get your first healing spell right now, because you did great on that. 
That was useful, wasn't it? I'm really getting the hang of this. I'll say. I thought this was a test. It was, and you aced it. You got 110% because you made a joke in one of the thing in one of the margins, which I found hilarious. D don't tell the other teachers about that, though. They'll kill me. All right, now that I got that, uh, let me just check their goals. I might be wanting to reorient some of them now that I'm, I've got thoughts. Because to do, I should probably really have on sword and bow if I want to make him a good assassin. Felix on both magics because his swordmanship is already going up. You two on heals so that you can get better healing faster. Uh, mercy on axe. I'm on this. Okay, that's good. We like that. Ingrid. Um, I don't really know why I gave you authority. I mean, obviously it's good to have that up, but as soon as I give you one battalion, it, it'll continue to rise anyways. Usually by the end of the game, most people have very good authority stats. So maybe I should just put you on both. Maybe I should just focus reason for the now, actually, because we really need you to get lots of spells fast so you can be our good magic dealer. Magic dealer? That was weird that I said that. And you two can continue going on horses. I believe in you to do that. I'd like you to explain something. I'll do my best, but I don't know. Though I have served his highness for four years, he has eluded my every attempt to learn his favorite foods. That's because he can't taste. <laughs> so he doesn't have many, but try asking someone who's known him for a long time. I don't want to say that because it'll because he's known him for a long time, so he'll feel left out about that. Sounds like you need to resort to trial and error. Maybe he just likes everything. Oh, actually, this is tough. I mean, this is sort of a logical idea, but there aren't many people who know, have known him for a long time, right? They're either dead or him, <laughs> so he probably wouldn't like this. Uh, sounds like you need to resort to trial and error. I mean, he might just be okay with, with going for that. Maybe he just likes everything. Uh, I don't think he wants to hear that. He wants to know what's best for Dimitri, so I'll try this. I don't think you understand the situation. That was his least favorite thing. I'm very sorry to do. You're right. I oh man, you get a lot of points for answering it, even if you answer wrong. I'm sorry. You're right. Maybe I didn't understand the situation. You're looking for an easy one. It's Lawrence's birthday. Well, I don't. Even though I don't really want to buy you flowers, I would be really mean if I did not I did it for everyone else. And well, despite the thing together. about me and Lawrence, he's not like the worst human, and I don't want to be mean to him. This should be easy. Yeah, it's been easy already, right? All you're doing after is cleaning up after a trouble. horse. Nicely done, you two. It seems I've improved. Yes, you have. Well, that worked out. Yes. Am I making progress? I would say you are. All of you are making progress. I'm so dang proud. Okay, the unfortunate thing about this is that they now are all very less motivated. And if I want to get that their motivation back up, I have to go over another explorer. But I also really, really need them to do fights. So I think I'm probably going to take them out to fight this time. Oh, I could go to the mountains or the empire. We only get one, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, let's do the, the one with the higher level, though, for sure. And then maybe next... Because we'll still be able to, to raise some people's uh, skills a little here. And then maybe next free day, we do another explore. And then next free day after that is another battle. Maybe that's how we'll do this. It's too bad we can't buy gifts from anyone yet. I can't wait till we do that. Because once you buy, are able to buy the gifts, then you can give them out and raise people's motivation really easily without having to spend your activity points to take them out places. All right, so everyone's coming, obviously. Have you gotten... You don't have a, an attack spell yet, do you? Oh, oh, no, but you're so close. Dang. So I really do want to get XP for you this turn, so you're not lagging behind once you finally do get your spells. I also need it for Annie. She's got to get good at doing stuff with axes. I can't wait till you learn Lightning Axe, too. That's a very good skill for you, because you have good magic. And once you- and if the thing is, like, it's a really powerful melee attack that you can do, and it takes only three durability, I think, so for a training axe, you can do it, like, many times. Especially once you get your training axe plus, when you get the blacksmith, but that's all in the future. Alright, and you and Sylvain can go around healing people even a little more still, which is good. And Mercy, we can start filtering that out. Oh, why do you still have Dimitri's bow? Silly me. Alright, does anyone have- oh, I don't need this stuff all on my person. Oh, the phone array. I'd like that back, though. Oh, I still haven't sold all those bullions yet for some reason. I can do that right now. I'll do that in a minute. I'll do it right now, actually. One. one? It is the one. You're welcome, a bunch. Dun, 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 dun. I'll buy you another iron sword just while you're still getting out of the axe phase. Well, actually, yeah, at this point, you're probably about equally good with both, right? Oh, wait, what? You're not even... Oh, right, no, because I haven't been teaching you axe because you're me. <laughs> Shoot, okay. Um, I should be attending seminars or something. All right, so I'll, I'll buy you another iron sword then for the time being, so that just that you can keep yourself afloat while you're learning axes. Wait, where did I go in the menu? What the hell? Oh, why am I at the bottom here? Did I unsortie myself by mistake? Oh, I should really decide whether I want to make you Gremory or Mortal Savant, because if I'm making you Mortal Savant, then I will actually want the sword practice. I think I'm going to go Gremory, because I don't have very many uh, magic-only people on my party at the moment, really. I guess Sylvain and Ash will be. Anyways, oh, and Battalion Guilds, we got two new battalions I just bought. Let's put those on, baby! Uh, Dimitri, let's give you one. Um, actually, does anyone have... 
uh, authority C. Th that's, that, those cane rights are gonna be pretty useless to me for the time being, but that's all right. Who do we want to have a battalion? Probably who's gonna be up front and doing stuff? Sylvain! And what is, actually, what's, what's the battalion about? That's the question. Um, it's about, so it's less physical attack. Oh, this is the stride one, so we, we want to do this to one of our healers, so it'll either be Ash, well, let's give it to Ash then, because he's already not doing tons of melee damage, so we can lower that a little bit. Hopefully I didn't forget anything. I mean, I guess I could try and, let's see, should I set them up in a different way? Oh, I should swap them so that they go by the, their student uniforms, because Dimitri looks way better in his student uniform. I mean, I guess this, this is the way this is laid out is fine. Where am I? Oh, right, no, I unsorted myself by mistake. Let me put me over here with these folks. All right, let's go do for this. So we only get one battle. Oh, let's change the music. We already did this one. Do I have funeral flowers? Here it is. <laughs> let's do this just for this super dramatic music for this tiny ass little little bandit raid. Sure. We'll move up here. I'll have Sylvain take up the front because he's much more better at uh, blocking here. Oh, and I could stride everyone right now if I wanted, and I don't. Even though we intend to have Sylvain be a healer later. Actually, why am I where are both my healers over here? I should move someone over here. That was dumb. But it's fine, we've got Mercy over here. Uh we want well, let's have Ingrid here so that wait, is she gonna get destroyed? Not all the way destroyed, but she's gonna be hurt. And then to do we can do some stuff and then maybe Felix can come over and help. This is probably a decent way to start. Let's move uh, poor Archer over here out of the fire zone. And let's put you in the bushes, but with a training sword. The piano. So good. Ah. <laughs> all right, let's carry on here. So Savannah's doing all right here. We're getting hurt a bit though, because we're still way under leveled for all this stuff. But we'll be making it up with these training missions. Don't make you no mistake. Although there are a lot of people and they're really close together. That's unfortunate. Time to clean house. Uh, let's mark you just so that we don't accidentally get anyone else totally wrecked with that. All right, so what to do, I, do, I think you should go for an axe smash. I will break yes, do 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 do. Womp. So dope. Luck wasn't with you. That um. The <laughs> railing kind of ruined it, but that's fine. We get to get me some decks. Oh, that's fine I've though. Improved. Yeah, having that defense will be really great, and the speed. This worked out well. That is also something I want for you. Yes, indeed, great work. Oh, you have too many skills on, so you didn't equip the five HP thing already. But once plus that, it'll be thirty-seven. That's really good. No one else has that, do they? Not even Dimitri. Sweet. Da, 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 this thing now. Wait for the music. I've got it. I don't know how to play piano. Ah, this music is so good. Boom, 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 boom. It's still too bad that you don't have any um, like swings you can do with this. Oh, but you get 80% chance to kill to take that down. So I'll have you do the onslaught in second here, just as soon as I'll have Dimitri just tweaking this person. Dun. Oh, my favorite part of the song is coming back. Actually, wait, hang on. Dun, 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 dun. Bum, bum, bum. Training mission in the woods with some random peeps. All right, so the one thing here is if I miss here, um, then they get to retaliate, and it's not so with the onslaught, but this is actually the same hit chance, so I'll go for it anyways. Yay! It did. Well done, Mercy. Um, okay. So ye... Okay, so you might go after... You'll go after Felix if you can't get, um... Should I fall back? Yes. Oh, you're actually going after Mercy. Uh, can you take down Mercy in one turn? Is that why you're doing it? No, you're just doing it because you're dumb. Cool. Because uh, Felix would probably be the better option, actually. And I'll have uh, Annette go over here to... Uh, Annette, why did I say that? Annette go over there to help provide some support. Maybe, Ash, uh, heal up your buddy there. So, Vane, you and I can work about taking this down. I'll give a hit here, just that you don't have to take the full brunt of that. Start with a Wrath Strike. So, wrath Strike. Wrath Strike. And I'll do Temple Sense here just for the extra accuracy. What's next is this guy. <laughs> oh wait, he can do pass, right? So he's gonna go to the Ash over here. That's unfortunate. Please don't crit. Okay, good. We managed. All right, more are coming, but that's all right. We can skip through this mostly because they're just gonna go over here and hit Mercy. Okay, so let's uh, unmark the you and now mark the real threats who are everyone coming up this way. We've got some mages coming in too, so that's not awesome. Um, but these people are mostly in our territory now, so we don't have to really worry about it. I would say, oh, this part of me is clear too. Violent. Man, I shouldn't have put this song on. I'm gonna not be playing and just listening it the whole time. Okay, um, focus up here. Dun, 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 dun. 
Oh, I missed. That was awful. Snap out of the music. Let's do this. All right, your best thing here would be if I got you this person down to five damage. So can we, can the combination of Annie and Mercy do this? Oh, wait, actually, maybe not because Annie or Mercy is about to die. That could be an issue. Maybe Mercy could do it with Gambit, though. Go for that. I believe in you, Dimitri. Don't miss this up. Yay, you did it. All right, I did shove them, which is not which is an unfortunate side effect, actually. But they're stunned, so they won't be able to move um, even next turn anyways. And he could do a little wind on them? Maybe that'll kill them, so... Ah, that's better, because the other people coming um, Ingrid's way anyways. Ah, oh, you're still level one? Dang, man. Oh, wait. The steel sword is not good. We don't want to do steel sword. We want to hit you with rest strike so you don't get two hits on me. So uh, Ash would be the better person we need to do this with, but he's not going to be able to take down with it, so we want Sylvain to do it instead, because he can actually do this. Ash can just get his XP up and stuff. He'll... Old me old there. Great, level three. Nice. Magic and Dex. Joke? I'm sorry, Ash. <laughs> I made, maybe maybe it was overhyped that a little. It is only two stats, but magic is a good one for you to have as a healer. Alright, so you're totally fine. Ingrid is not totally fine. Ingrid is the opposite of totally fine. Well, we can make her totally fine if we use these. A few people are gonna walk our way this turn, that's about it. Um, and these guys are seeming to be staying up there a bit. Okay, it's unfortunate that the two mages are staying here, but we can probably outrun them for one turn. Let's unmark these so we can just try and stay out of their range. Or could Dimitri even take out that last one, maybe? No. Can't wait till you get Hunter's Volley. That's a really good move. Among my favorite combat arts in the whole game. Alright, if I could get anyone down to- if I could get to down to- down to health- to health where I can actually do stuff though. That would be the good thing. Okay, so 17 there and then 5 there. So that's 21. So that does not leave you with an amount of health. Where oh, and you're doing this for too anyway, so you're gonna be responding. Urk. Okay, well, Ingrid will get you some kills somehow, I promise. But just, just give me a minute. I'll, I'm working on it. I missed. Bugger. Uh, that's bad. I've still got three pulses though, so it's fine. Um, we don't want to do this probably. Oh, maybe we do actually, because you have good res. Have an yeah! This isn't so hard. And does that push you guys both back now so we can do a melee attack? Because that would be very good to know. Oh, not when it's up close. Maybe it's only if there's just one person. I see. Okay, so this one's going to do five times two, which would kill her if I didn't heal her with... Neither of my healers are close. So my only option then is to kill one of them, but no, I don't have any ranged attacks that could do that, so that's unfortunate. Okay, well, she's basically dead then in that case. That's not good. Um, Unless this misses, which it probably won't. Let me just back that up, actually. Maybe I should do the, the onslaught first so that... Oh, no. Well, I should have Ash heal her first before she does anything so that she doesn't die when she goes over there. Ooh, My lessons are nice. Now I'll try the gambit. Hopefully it doesn't miss now that without Dimitri's support. I think it hit. I wasn't, I was kind of skipping through, so I didn't see if I got the XP for it. Okay, good. So now Dimitri will probably have a way less, uh, way lower chance to miss. Oh yeah, he could even do double hits here, which would be great. Although he could kill in one shot with this, which would give him not a chance to retaliate and heal, which is better. Um, couldn't kill that person, but we can send a melee person in right now to do that. How could Ingrid do even? Not stupendously. Maybe we won't send anyone there. Mercy will just tank that. Okay, uh, do I have a battalion yet? No. Syl Sylvain has one. Yes? No. No, none of the people over here have them. That's disappointing. Um, but we can kind of handle ourselves over here. Okay, if I do Steel Sword, you get two hits on me and I go down, so that's bad. But this way, things are okay. So long as we end up killing one of you this turn. Or maybe I just have Sylvain heal you. Oh, wait, no, you guys can pass through, so you'll be able to go and kill people. So I'm little killer! You're my style! Actually, I'll stand you here so that they can't get to Mercy, at least. And they're probably gonna go after other people in that case. Okay, they're both going after Sylvain now, so I'm gonna put him in the bushes, heal Byleth, and now they're both going after me! I'm oh, sorry, D uh, Dimitri. Oops. Oh, well. Ooh. Even though Dex is steel, Dex and, Dex and defense, not bad, not bad. Would like more magic for you sometimes. Okay, so they're both going after Dimitri and won't even be able to hurt him, really. So I could have... Uh, if I have Felix try to attack him, though, he'll probably just get himself into trouble. So we'll put him in the, the woods beside Dimitri, so the only one of them can go after him. All right, I think we're good then. And I'll just have you rally uh, uh, Ingrid for friendship points. Great. And you heal so that you can be doing stuff more next turn. Are there any other ones over there coming up? Oh, they are. Big times. Okay, what are you doing? I don't care. It's fine. We live. Where are you going, though? Okay, I do care a little, but I'll skip through it. Oh, I missed you, did I? Okay, uh, let's mark all of these people. This is where we don't go. So if I didn't throw some wind out here just so she's getting some XP. And then Ingrid can even finish this one off. Bonk. She aims for greatness, and you will have it when I make you a mage and stop messing around here. Dimitri, okay, let's put, who should we put, should we put someone here as a dodge tank? Maybe even, uh, ooh, no, but you have lots of big, oh, here's an idea. So we have Dimitri start off by needling this person over here. 
to do rushes and to finish it with the steel swords so that no one's gonna, not, only like a few people can hit him. That's good. Oh, he has Rast Strike with the sword now. That's really good. Okay, but we won't use it for this because it's not necessary. So this person can go pass through and go after Mercy. So we want to block off their opportunities to do that. This archer person can do good against things. Oh, this archer is thankfully not as fast as all those ones who were in that other mission. That was awful. This one's only got six. Even still, I want Mercy over here, probably, to do this. Um, doesn't have the combat art yet. Okay, let's see if we can make it so that this, uh, she can finish this person off, so... Try and do, like, 24 damage to them with other people, which should be easy enough. Uh, Felix is kind of squishy, though, so we don't want to make him put him to do that. Uh, but no one else can really reach Byla, so let's have her hit again here. And Ash still in a vulnerable position, but if we're going to kill this person this turn, then it's all right. Actually, I guess we won't. Let's let's keep Mercy safe. Let's have her spend her turn healing Ash, and Ash can go spend his turn healing Felix, I guess? Because that heals Mercy as well is the cool thing. Cool that Ash is getting that bank out of XP, and then hopefully Sylvain can take this down. Great just job. Do. And now we just have to worry about the people who are actually coming over here. One going after Dimitri again. To do to do Dimitri, to do Okay, so we're in pretty good standing here, I'd say. Uh, Dimitri might be in trouble if, if Archer hits with poison stuff, and then this person comes after him. So should I put Felix here? Or does that... I guess men, not many people can hit Felix here, and he's gonna be faster than that archer by a fair bit, so this is probably safe. We've still got our pulses, I think. Okay, so this is gonna hurt to do a little, but he's standing strong. Would've hurt him less if I had him stand there and get his defense buff, but it's cool. This person going after Felix. That was a good call on my part, I think, to put him there. And now no one else can go over here. He's gonna announce for to do. This for to do is not nice, because to do has not got the res. Okay. And this person's going after Ingrid, when they probably could have killed Dudu, so that was not a good plan on their part. Ow! Poison arrows. Now, this is sort of an awkward formation, because we don't have many good battalions that can reach them here, but, um... And no one at, at, at present, really, is tanky enough to just sort of go all along with this. Uh, let's see about getting a curve shot on this person here, and maybe Dudu can finish them. And then, uh, 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 Felix can come up and take some of the heat for him, maybe? Let's try that. Or maybe we just have to do back out altogether, and then have Felix finish this fool. Yeah, that's probably smart. I can still serve. Aww. To do. <laughs> You're much more than that. So he could take this person out if he does this. Uh, and then he's... He makes everyone feel safe, doesn't he? Do you go over here and take out this guy? Oh, he could even do it without a combat art. Sweet. Um, let's have Ash heal you before there so that Ash doesn't have to go... Or let's have Sylvain do it because he's a little tankier right now. And have you finish this guy off. Why am I even here? Why am I even here? I don't know, man. Go home. <laughs> Great, now you're much even speedier, too. So all kinds of good things are coming from this. All right, so you guys, so you're gonna go after him because you're blocked in, okay, so actually all of you are blocked. None of you have passed, so you're ganging up on Sylvain here and you're going after me because I'm wounded to heck. Um, so I'm just gonna get out of your way. Also, Ingrid will get out of your way in a minute. I don't wanna move Annette until I know what I'm doing with her because she can use Rally, which is very helpful. Um, I guess I'll have her use Rally on to do in case someone goes after him like, with the bow, maybe because that way he'll be faster and dodgier and stuff. I don't really know where I'm going with that. So much left Ooh, nice! Learn. Oh, you learned Nosferatu! That's great, you have an attack spell with magic. That's dope! Great, so you're going after... So these are guys are all going after Felix. That's 6 plus 12 plus 10 is uh, 28 total if you all hit, which will actually kill him if you all hit. Oh, shit, we don't want that. Can I Can I perhaps convince one of you into going after uh, 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 Mercy here? Okay, so you're 17 times... Wait, no, what's your speed is 6, right? her three so if I equip the heal you only get one shot is that right yes uh, so you probably won't kill then and you're gonna try and do that and hopefully not kill Felix or anyone in period let's try that that might be bad but let's do it all right nice didn't dodge that yet all right you've got your your HP up that's good nice okay I, I, I parried very well with that okay is the archer gonna go after Felix anyways okay yeah they are ah there it goes Oh, you're doing a pretty good job of it now. All right, okay, you're not running away that easy, Felix. We're starting that again. Let's actually even go back a turn before that, because I think I made some bad uh, choices. All right, and let me change this music, too, because it's it totally distracting me with how epic and, and amazing it is. Uh, this is even better, so let's not do that. Let's just change it to... Sure, this one's contemplative. This will help me focus. Strategize, as it were. Perhaps we shouldn't be trying to rush up here so quickly. We should try to be holding down here so that they have to funnel through there. They've only got one more person with pass, so we're alright if we take these two down. Okay, let's let's go for it. Sylvain helps me take out this. I think this is good for these two to do this in the corner here. We do want to move them up there at the front, though, so that they are not having their talents wasted, so to speak. Let's have Mercy heal Ash for some XP. And sure, why not have Ash heal Mercy from... Actually, let's keep Ash on standby in case anyone else really desperately needs healing by the end of this. Can we have Dimitri weaken this person up and then, uh... 
Ingrid land a killing blow, maybe. Only one damage, but she can do it. Over already? Indeed, over already. A lot of ranged people around here are uncomfortable with that I am. Do you just sort of rally to do for that extra little speed? And maybe you guys can just sort of work together to block off uh, poor Ingrid over here. Although she's pretty durable right now. Although I am letting someone in to go attack Mercy, but it's the person with the magic, so they're not going to be able to kill her. So who is everyone going after now? You're going after Mercy. You're going after Ash, which I don't want. And you're going after Annie and you'll be able to not be able to kill. So let's have Ash move out of the way. Then where's that person who was going after Ash go? It's the Archer, and they're going after Byleth now. And I did- I put her in a position where she can just be killed now, so she's going to die because I did not heal her. And everyone walks so damn slow. Grr. Okay, well, there's a chance they miss, I guess. Let's just skip through it and see if- Oh, Annie died! I don't know how I did that. Okay, maybe we go back even one more turn. How about that? Yes, this is nice. When there's nobody around, okay. We don't want to be moving all the way up to the four, four fronts there, where in, in their territory. We want to get rid of these these ones post haste. Maybe can you do your gambit here? Because you have probably have good magic defense, right? Five. It'll probably be all right. You'll block them anyways, if nothing else. All right, you got them both. Nice. So they're both stunned now. So that's very good. And now let's focus our efforts on taking these ones out, and we can go over there with some ranged attacks if we have the time. If you see what I'm saying. Go over that. Sylvain can pull a dope it. thing here. Let's have him do it with the better lance. Uh, that's not very great chances to hit, so let's have him not do it with the better lance. And hopefully Felix can finish this off. Whoops. Yes, he can. Um, all right, so this one's gonna go after Ash. Uh, I guess I'll use Dimitri for the for the kill on this one, just that I don't. That just to cover our bases on this front. So this way, these people are all gonna run down this turn, and that's fine because we'll we'll have that turn. To this, these people won't be doing much to Annette here. We can maybe retreat after that happens a little. Okay, so I'll heal up Ash like I was doing before. Italian level up, yay! Plus one to hit. Go there with Ash. His skill goes back up for the HP plus five, which we really okay. desperately want. Ingrid is ready. What should I do? Dimitri wants to know what to do. To do, I meant. Both D names. I guess that's why I was screwed up. You two are going to attack Annette, and then everyone else is going to move forward. Yay, Annette level two. Well done. Aw, this stinks. It does not stink. It, it's very good. The magic will be very helpful for your lightning axe and for the aura gauntlets if we ever end up doing that. Okay, but now they're all... This is similar to what we had before, but we're all on the right here, so they can't just get to all of us, which is my, well, my was my main problem. Okay, so these people have the same range as Annette, so if she runs over here, they'll be able to just sort of hit her still. But not so for everyone else. I'll have uh, Ash heal her, though. And then Mercy heal him in turn. Or Sylvain heal. No. Mercy heal Sylvain. Sylvain heal Ash. And she got an authority up from that, did she? Yeah. Healers going in a row, healing each other, getting all kinds of XP. And now, uh, let's try and move. Let me uh, mark this one. Just kind of. Because we want to be out of these melee ranges for sure. We want them to come right in front of us without having getting a hit on, off on us. And we want to do to not be in range of the mages for sure. Dimitri. Oh, we don't want to put them all the way over there. I guess this is probably what we want. And one of the mages is going to go after Felix, is that right? Okay, 77% chance is not that bad. It'll be even better if I put on this. And eat this. Let's see where they all go. Skip this turn. I don't really care. What? Did that person just crit her? Is that what happened? He was at full- Oh no, wait, what? Oh, the archer came down and- Oh, wait, Divine Pulse has zero charges. Is that- Did I read that correctly? Oh. Well, that means we lost. I'll be right back when I'm roughly as far as I was. I have no hard feelings. <laughs> I have no hard feelings. We're doing this now, we are. Had to be done. This man just critted and then his axe's model didn't even load in before he You're so on top <laughs> did his of it. Just thing. You're so on top of it. I love when she says that. It's the most adorable thing. I'm starting to see results. Feeling stronger. I'm more or less back where we were, except in a little better standing, I think. Oh, there's still a lot of people coming right at the end here, which is uncomfortable. Can we kill you with Ingrid? No, she still can't get the kills. How sad. But if you work together with Ash, you can. And as long as he doesn't crit you. And how many of these do I have? Tons, because I just restarted, right. Let's hope he doesn't crit you. That would be very sad. But I'm also down one healer if I do that. That's fine. We need this XP, man. Okay, good. And you got the commoner thing. Sweet. Do this, and good. 94% chance. Good. Very good. Very good. Lots of XP. Very good. Good, 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 good. Now. Oh, uh, how are you both going after Felix? Uh, you actually wouldn't kill him. Uh, unless- well, I mean, if you went up here, only one person can melee- Okay, so then this person would melee him. 17 damage to his 6. 11 plus 11 plus 6 is 28 already. Okay, so he's- that's not good. We don't want that. So we should definitely run here. 
I will stay vigilant. And they're all piling on any. Uh, should I have a rally anyone? Uh, wait. I'll have a rally, uh, Byleth, I guess. Maybe I can have Byleth kind of block this area off a little. Actually, if I put Byleth up here, then the, the, the big boss will come after her, right? And then she'll be able to kill them, I guess. Kill them dead. Oh, the archers already naturally get a plus one to their range. This person can retaliate with me even if I do curve shot. That's not fee. Ooh, I could kill this person with the iron sword, but I just, I would be very wounded if I did that. Could this person kill Sylvain? They sure could, and I have no one else to Oh, Mercy can heal him. No, Mercy doesn't have a position to heal him, because I put uh, Annie here. That's not good. Oh, and, and Ash is also about to die. Wait, who's going to get magic? Oh, this person's going to magic Ash. Then I need Mercy to heal this, to heal Ash. Is the archer also going after Ash? Oh, that's bad. Twelve. Um, maybe we, Mercy and uh, Sylvain can both heal Ash, and that's what they're doing this turn. All right, now that one's going after do to do because if he's a... Uh, it, it would seem that they can take this other person on, can take an Ash by himself, by themselves. Spain's up a level. That's fun. Now where's everyone going? You're still going after him. Okay, so in theory we survived this. Bylas is in trouble. Let's have her just heal herself, but then stand there strong so that she can take some hits and do some damage. Now we just have to do standing here, so let's just have him stand there for that extra defense. Not that, I mean, the only person attacking him is the mage. It's just so we don't screw anything else up. I think we survived this, owing to no crits or weirdness. <laughs> get, die, get out of my way. Now the axe person's gonna come after Bylas as well, and she gets two hits on them, I think. You might even be able to kill them too. One, two! And I even get healed a bit from that. Should I hope I Archer doesn't go after me now. Okay, no. They're sticking with their original plan. Don't crit me! No. Okay. No! <laughs> Just dodge out of the way with the lance in one hand. That's funny. Okay. Did that. So we survive. Okay, how many of those pulses do I have? Two still. I can make two fatal mistakes and we'll still be all right. All right, you can't go very far, but you are our strongest person at the moment. I think I probably will want to do to be tanking physical here and then try and get other people to kill the mages, I guess? Or maybe we could have Ash heal up to do over here. Oh wait, do you have Nosferatu yet? Or did I de delete that by losing the game? Oh, I deleted it by losing the game. I no longer have Nosferatu. <laughs> um, so if I do this, what if I just do this and like try and just wreck this person here? Oh my God, they will destroy me. That's not what I want. It, it may surprise you to learn. Wait, who of us has, oh, Dudu is the one with the the, th the assault troop. We can work with that. Be mindful. Byleth probably should do this person. And then I guess uh, Dimitri can finish that off. Oh, do you have a gambit on you? Nah, so we'll just finish off the archer, sure. Let's get one more problem out of our way. Now we have just the two mages. So one of them's going after to do won't actually be able to do much. The other one's going after Sylvain, won't be able to do that much, but we'll kill him as it stands. And this one's going after to do will hurt him pretty tremendously. I don't understand. I guess this one's going after Sylvain because they can get a kill on him, theoretically. Uh, I think I want to put Sylvain, uh, or sorry, to do right here, just to absolutely solidify him as a wall there. Maybe we have Felix come up and try and kill the cons can't do tons of damage there. I just know as soon as I heal this per um Sylvain, this person's definitely gonna go after to do and then and then that'll be bad. Don't really know how to prevent that from happening though without killing them, and I don't know how to kill them. I should have used Dimitri for that probably, and then had Felix come up and melee it. That's probably what I should have done. And found some other way to take out the archer. Oh, I should have had to do take out the archer. What am I stupid? Okay, um Okay, it's fine. Let's just try this for the moment. Maybe we have Annie come up and die, so that's not gonna work. Mercy come up with an axe attack, because she has good res. Ooh, no, Mercy come up with the the gambit. There's an idea. This is it. Nice. That pushes you up there, which is actually even better than I, what I was thinking of. And now, uh, okay, so you're going, who is this bandit going after? Mercy, this person's going after Dudu. Okay, so actually they wouldn't even really be able to kill Dudu here. So 13 plus, because 13 plus nine is 22. It's still not great for Dudu. Um, but if I could take out one person, it'll be even better. And also this person will not be able to reach Mercy anymore if I do this, which is a very good. So we do that. And now this person's going after Dudu and this person's going after Felix. And even if this person changed their mind and went after Felix, I think he'd be fine. So I think we'd, we've done this now. And if I put Sylvain here, that's bad news. So let's have him just stand here and heal so, um, Ash. And Annie, rally Dimitri for your buddy. That was Sylvain that I picked, so I'm stupid, but it's fine. And I think we're okay here. Unless crazy crits or whatever. No, that's good. I don't think, I think, uh, so I think Felix will survive even if this other person changes to go after him. No, they didn't. They're still going after to do. Okay, good. Now I've got this in the bag. Even with two divine pulses to spare, it's almost like I suddenly remember how to play the game. Okay, uh, we don't want to do that. Although for the memes, I will do this. <laughs> Wait, no, I shouldn't be doing it for the memes. I'm almost lost here. Does it work? Hey, it worked. Nicely done to do. And up the level for you, because that was a boss. Okay. Better to serve his highness. Speed and defense. Dope. That'll be n gnarly, bro, for when you're a, a rogue. And uh, can Mercy finish this off? Oh, can Ingrid finish it off better yet? Yes, she can. Do it. 
Do it. Do it. You weren't ready. You weren't ready. All right, please let me get some magic for this. That would be dope. Almost everything but magic, but those are still good stats to have. Res will be good for when you're a mage. And now, how are we going to deal with this? Okay. We finally don't have anyone at level one anymore, which is very nice. Ash, oh no, sorry. Annie is still at level uh, two, though. She can, will she die if she gets hit by the Nosferatu? She sure will, unless we have our, our special Healy boys just juzzer up a little bit first. Special Healy boys. Here goes. Um, can you just do a hit with your axe? Oh, it won't even be as good as, um, oh no, but you got smash. Ooh, do smash. Do smash with the iron axe. Smash! Womp! And now we have these bunch. Uh, and let's have Mercy also go with an axe. You don't have smash yet, do you? No. That's alright, though. Because you're not going to get any damage from this. Because this person, <laughs> uh, you're zero res tank. Alright. And so we have to Dimitri just fire one far arrow with a training bow. Won't take you out. Put you down to one health so that anyone could take you out. And that anyone's going to be Felix because I'm at level 5. Vigilant. Oh, I'm always vigilant. Ignore the times where we lost. Yay! That means I can class up Felix now. Oh, marvelous. Ooh, black sand steel. That's good for crafting crit weapons when we do that, which will be later when we get a blacksmith. This this game is a lot weirder to record for because there's a lot more... It's almost like a more... I don't want to say open world experience because it's obviously wrong, but like it's definitely not as rigid as uh, recording something like... Path of Radiance even, despite being from the same series and the same general format, it's like because I have this whole month of, of things to do, that's like a whole other component from the, of the game from the main story missions, where you need to prepare for the main story missions, because if you don't prepare right, you're screwed. All right, let's see who still has any motivation after all that. I think we probably have four people to teach. Oh no, just three. Oh, unfortunate. All right, well, we'll teach them all then. And to do what we're we teaching you, because you're going to be a, a rogue, we want you to have swords and, and bows. Oh, you still don't have very much in your bow, uh, but I want to get your sword up first, because that's, like, pr mostly your bread and butter, I would think, as a, as a rogue. Felix, my boy, my dancery boy, um, could still get some magic up for you yet. That would be nice. Especially in this one, because... Well, let's just start on this one, because you have a little Quite aptitude intriguing. thing for this one. With the little stars. Quite intriguing. There you go, got one star. And Mercy, our resident warrior-to-be. Let's get your axes even up higher. You got it. I've never been more sure of anything in the entire world. Yes. All right, great. So you do that and that, yes. and soon we'll be at rank D with you, and you'll get up to the the little two two aptitude thing, which will be the best. I need you to be at D plus for the the level two aptitude. Anyways, and it was just check my goals to make sure I'm not being ridiculous with this. Ash and Sylvain are about to go up uh, in faith level. Good mercy, there, there, there. Yeah, it's all good. It's looking good to me. All right. Lecture time, off and away, and hopefully I can raise someone's motivation by answering a question. Nope, no one has Here's questions result, for me. Professor? Sad. Here we go. Very well done, you two. Can't wait till you're best I friends and you can do it even better. You okay, you've got heal this? as well, that's good. I'm you've really got Nosferatu, which you learned before I died, I'm and so did you. And now you've got Blizzard. Blizzard sounds cool. I've never used Blizzard in this game. What is Blizzard? Sweet. It's Edelgar's birthday. Thanks. Happy birthday. I'm still feeling that axe wound you hit me with, by the way. It will never heal. We could certify, we could um, do Felix now, right? Yeah. And he'll make Myrmidon easily, although it means he'll no longer be able to use that magic that he just got. So should I make him a mage? It doesn't actually tank, put down any of his stats. So he's still, still be just as good with a sword. Screw it. Well, let's make him magic until um, he learns Dancer, which happens later in the story. You got it, Felix. And get that little stat bonus Easy. with the magic and stuff. Easy. <laughs> cool. Hokey doke. Um, I'm just trying to remember if you... Nah, that doesn't do it. Never mind. All right, so... Oh, who else is level... No, 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 no one else is level five. But we're, we're, we're getting there. Dudu will soon be able to take... Uh, go up into... I guess he has to go to Myrmidon first before Thief, right? And Assassin is only... Assassin is far away anyways. Assassin is down here, isn't it? Oh, I could also make you a hero. Oh, you look so good in the hero gear! Okay, he also looks really dope in the assassin's gear, though. And with the ponytail and everything. And I also kind of had my heart on him being an assassin, just because seeing him do flips is something I need. And because it's always nice to have an assassin. I think probably we'll want Ash as a bishop, and then we'll have uh, Sylvain as... Is Holy Knight even advanced, or is it a master? It is an advanced, actually. So maybe they'll both be Holy Knights. Maybe that's good for them. And Mercy, we're going to go from uh, the Brigand to... So, Pal so Brigand, I guess, is where you end off. No, no, Warrior, sorry, is where you end off. Let's, let's have a glimpse into your future. Wow, the future is bright. <laughs> look at 
get that spike polish. You could probably just kill someone with that. Who needs weapons? And little Annie is going to be... Oh, this is, this is my favorite. Annie in the Fortress Knight. She's Actually, it's, it's even cuter with the armor one because, like, it, like, covers part of your face. So it looks like she's just, like, slightly too small for the armor, even though it looks like that on everyone. All right, that's cool. And we're going to have... Uh, Ingrid's going to be our warlock for a time and then turn to Gremory when we get that. So that's dope. And also very unlike Ingrid. All right, and that means, I suppose, let's first, let's replenish our battalions. Well done, all of you battalions. You helped us a little bit. And Smith is not yet open. And we're going to take another explore day to get everyone's motivation back up for the next teaching session. That's what we're doing. And we have three points for it, too. I say we spend them all on meals. Ooh, actually, we should spend one of them on, on actually, like, making a meal so that we can... Let's do it with the do, my boy. Uh, and let's... What are we, what are we gonna add to everyone? We got lots of Tutata Spike. Oh, it's just one Tutata Spike to do it, so hell yeah, let's do that. Give everyone a little boost on the defense. I enjoy cooking. I hope so. Man, you're so tall, you don't even fit on the screen. You, seem to you also have the magical doing. power of just... Oh, no, it's not true. You flatter me. Magical ability of just looking at the pan and it just combusts into flame and that translates to we've made something yummy. All right, good. You can only do that once a week, so we've done that. Now let's have two meals. Uh, Felix and Ingrid will enjoy this one, so let's do that. This is just the today's special that we don't have to put anything in for. Me not having to do anything is good. <laughs> I appreciate any good meal. Nothing beats enjoying my favorite food. That looks the truth. appetizing. That looks appetizing. <laughs> like, it's just like he can't even say it nor say normally like, oh, that looks yummy. All right, we definitely want more skills on... I think I want Mercy and one of our healers to to go up in skills right now. So that'll be either Sylvain, Sylvain or Ash. And Sylvain's a little behind in that regard. So let's do try and find one that Sylvain and Mercy both like. Uh Oh, well, that's easy. Sweet Bun Trio. We did it. That was the, the easiest thing in the world. <laughs> what is it, a sweet bun trio? Oh, it looks so good. There's little jellies the off the head of it. How did you know, professor? Because of the blue arrows. Yeah, you just get it, professor. Yeah, you this just get favorite. it, professor. <laughs> oh, I love Sylvain so much. All right, dope. well, that's that's time already. Oh man, and everyone has supports now. Oh, we're gonna be watching supports. Oh, we have to watch supports now. Oh, it's support theater time. We might not even get to another battle here. We might just be watching supports. I can't believe that Manuela. I'm sorry. <laughs> but I must vent to some. That's what I'm here for. You're familiar with Manuela's slovenly behavior, yes? Somewhat. That woman. She borrowed a book last week and returned it with stains of unknown origin <laughs> on the cover and several pages either folded or torn. Knowing her, I have a few guesses of what the stains Just were. Now, she dropped a sandwich on the floor. <laughs> I love the delivery of this line. Kept eating. When she saw my shock, she said simply, three second rule. <laughs> It's so good. Uh, well, I hope you deal with that, Hanuman. Oh, you and Manuel are always button heads and head and butts. Where did I just say I was going to go? I just had an idea where I was going to go and I've lost it. No, I was just going to watch some supports. Ooh, wait, someone's dropped something and it's mine now. Oh, a map. Oh, it's, uh, okay. So it's a map of the forest by Gerald. So it's got to belong to either Alois or Leone. Let's check with Alois. Ooh, let's also see if there's any um, request things in the in the box so I can make someone happy with my terrible, terrible advice. There's one note. Yes. I wonder if I'll ever find a partner who understands I don't mean any harm when I flirt with others. Does someone like that really exist? I don't know, Sylvain. Um, have you considered giving up on flirting? Terrible. That's a dream that will never come true. Awful. You're bound to meet someone open-minded someday. It'll happen. Be optimistic. There we go. He he trauma flirts. It's it's <laughs> it's his thing. <laughs> One of his things. He's going through stuff, man. All right, let's watch the sports now. I, I've put this off. Dimitri and Dudu. Oh, that's gonna be so wholesome. Maybe, or maybe it's terrible. Your I can't house. remember. The hour is late. May I ask where it is you're going? <laughs> to bed, Dimitri. To do. <laughs> a bit of research before I train. After that, a bath and bed. Very well. I shall accompany you. To the bath? <laughs> Whoa, there. <laughs> uh, no, there's no need for that. I am a grown man after all. But he you likes your company. Injury during yesterday's training. My presence may be of use to you. It was a mere bruise that will heal and no, no need to fret over me to do. But he frets because his loyalty Please is, is fierce and me. a little a, a little much. <laughs> and there it is again. Yes. What is it? Well, you often choose to address me as your highness, which he doesn't like, despite insisting upon respectful terms for me, which when I didn't we like. First met, you used to call me by my name. That was because I was unfamiliar with Fodlin's speech. Thinking back, such rude manners were inexcusable. Man's too hard on himself, dude. It's hard to watch. I feel more comfortable being addressed by my name, rather than with the honorifics that go along with being a prince. But I did not teach you to read and write so that you'd know how to address me properly. Oh, he taught him to read and write too? Oh, that's so sweet. I didn't know that. I forgot about that. But your highness, 
A vassal is precisely what I am. That's how so he sees himself. But you're more than that. Argh, anger. <laughs> Even though I know how this ends happily with them together, but to like, argh, house, anger. <laughs> take an early night and reflect on what I've said. Please. I couldn't possibly. I said I would accompany you, did I not? You did, and then he asked you really heartfeltly not to do that. This mindset of yours. Ah, uh, okay. It wasn't as happy as I had, had hoped for. And there's other thing prob there's there are problems I have with Dimitri and Deduce supports, but we'll get to that later, I'm sure. Dimitri and Felix. Oh, this is going to be fun. Alright. All of Felix's C supports are well. just like, I literally would will, would kill you if not for the laws of this land. Go away. Just looking at your face makes me want to wretch. <laughs> Hello to you too. Of yours, you grow more like your brother every day. Shut up. And stop walking around on your hind legs. You're not fooling me. I cannot fathom why you seem to hate me so. No, because you're I a little thick, Dimitri. <laughs> Sorry to say. Beast craving blood. But also it's Felix. A beast craving blood, am I? I assume you're speaking of the events two years ago. Last time we met outside the academy? I am. The way you suppressed that rebellion. He was ruthless slaughter and you loved every second. Not every second. The there was one second where he wasn't killing anyone. How you watched them suffer. And your face, and that expression, all the world's evil packed into it. But is that really why you're angry at him? First no. <laughs> I remember Although I can imagine that leaving an impression. And he didn't instantly uh, deny it. Something wrong? Go ahead and deny it, you wild boar. I deny nothing, Felix. Well then, I suppose that the Dimitri <laughs> <and I once laughs> died during that slaughter in Dusker, along with my brother. Well, he changed, that's for sure. <laughs> Hurry up and get out of my sight. I don't make a habit of talking to beasts. Actually, you do. <laughs> you talk to a lot of things that you shouldn't while you're killing them. But, um, so thanks for that one, Felix. That's good. We needed that mood lifter up in our day after the absolute, uh, d you know, nightmare that was Dimitri and Dedu's sea support. Yours was obviously better. Dimitri and Mercy! This is ought to be cute. My goodness. Sword training again today? Don't overdo it, all right? I he could do, never. But thanks for your concern, he's not sword sense. training, he's using a bow. It's more of a hobby than anything, so don't worry too much. Clearly. Given your e, 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 e rank. I would probably just being be an asshole, what am I doing? But that's just me. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you say you hoped to take the sword test soon? That was before I realized it would mean working. <laughs> um. You're right. I completely forgot that's coming up. What should I do? Graham. To be honest, I've been a bit worried as I haven't seen you at the training ground much. Why didn't you say something sooner if you were so worried about me? It didn't occur to me that you could have forgotten. <laughs> Again, but Dimitri, right. a little, a little on the thick side, but oh. Why don't you let me help you with your swordsmanship? Hey, there's an Can idea. You do that for me. I'd really appreciate your help. Are you sure you can keep up with Dimitri though? He's a bit of a, okay. a, a tryhard in this department. We're short on time, we may have to overdo it a little. I to use your words. To it, but if we must, I'm my best. Well, 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 that is that is the the way of it, unfortunately. Don't tell me you've forgotten how to hold a sword. We have our work cut out for us. She never knew. I She's an axe wielder. Hold the sword without thinking about my grip, you know. Let's see what happens now. That you've shown me the proper way. <laughs> Let's see if doing it right does anything. <laughs> I was nervous at first, but just look at me now. <clears throat> I think you broke something. Oh. <laughs> I offering to help you would mean risking my life. Just his his composure. That's all. I'm so sorry. I don't know what happened. I just meant to swing the sword. I didn't think it would go flying like that. I'm impressed with how quickly you can do Maybe this has something got to do with the grip we were just yes. talking about. I know you didn't intend to murder me. <laughs> I know you didn't That's intend to murder me. <laughs> Maybe I'm not cut out for this whole sword fighting. No, no, you're just not good at holding them. Just Nonsense. do it without holding it. It's far too early to give up. Also First that, it was about five sword, seconds in. I was much like you. It's true that different people are better suited to different things. But if you keep at it and refuse to give up, you're certain to improve. I take that as Dimitri approving of my, uh, my, the way I'm dividing up my party. Do you really think so? Thank you, Dimitri. It's very kind of you to- Oh, there's a rip in your cuff, Dimitri. How do you- think I think I know how that happened. <laughs> it seems I didn't dodge your sword fast enough. Don't worry, I can easily... Oh repair. man, if it hit him in the cuff when he was just standing there like this, I assume, it was going straight for his abdomen when he dodged it. I'm the one who tore it, so I'll be the one who mends it. How does that sound? Uh, I guess no, fair, but Dimitri likes yourself. doing this stuff himself. He doesn't want to worry you. Focus on your exam. 
Aw, oh, that was cute. I liked that one. I do feel better about that. Demetri and Annie! Aw! Oh! Good morning, your highness. Getting in some early training, huh? You know him. Oh, it's not too terribly early. Oh, and all these supports are going to be good, because now we're going to be actually able to do lots of hey, better hits. Join me. It's a great way to start the day. I bet. Morning walk? <laughs> Funny. Gustav always kept the same habit. Did he now? You do remind me of your father, Annette. I hear that a lot. Oh, did you? I didn't realize that she knew that he knew his father, or her, her father. He was always busy with work, so he wasn't around much. But when he was home, he'd often take me with him for his walks. Annette, something's been weighing on me. Something I've done terribly wrong. <laughs> I killed a lot of people. <laughs> your father, he worked tirelessly. I don't know if I ever saw him take a rest. And you feel bad that you didn't ever tell him to? I feel as though, in a way, uh. he stole him from you. I'll admit it wasn't I don't remember these supports much because it was a long time ago. But I understand. Father loved his work. No one ever doubted That's that. no excuse. Actually, I've been thinking recently and that's too that forgiving. I'd like to talk to you more, your highness. Oh? Any reason in particular? Father was a man of few words. No, oh, to learn about your father. And my mother. But sometimes he would tell me about you. So you don't really feel like a stranger to me. Mm, that's sweet. In a way it's like I've known you for a long time. Almost as though you're my big brother. He's just like, that's weird. Leave me alone. <laughs> big brother? Oh, uh, I'm so sorry. I don't know why I let that slip out. That was rude of me. <laughs> no, not. I don't think Dimitri cares. I promise you, I don't mind at all. It's certain that my days would have been filled with more fun if oh. I had a little sister like you. That's adorable. What things did Gustav tell you about me? I'd love to hear more on this topic. Do you really want to know? Oh, I do remember this. She no, has some one, embarrassing story about him. Story about when you were a child, and you know what? Never mind. <laughs> I have a bad feeling about where this is going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How about you forget we had this talk all together? And don't mention it to anyone. Oh, wait, is this about... I think I might even remember what the, the, the embarrassing story is. Uh, I don't want to say it in case I'm wrong and I'll be an idiot. Ooh, to do an ash. These are like the best ones. These are At really good. Year, the fish are fat. Simply grilling them will bring out their best flavor. Steaming them with herbs is delicious, too. Wow. He knows all the you things. Know I don't know this. anything. I'm learning so much from you, Do. <laughs> Were you a cook Ditto, in Ash. Castle in Ferdiad? No. Did your family own an eatery of some kind? No. No. <laughs> My sister and I helped with cooking at home. I love just the, the resolute, no. <laughs> I was not a cook, nor did I own an eatery. Wow, that's all? I thought I was confident about my skills, but next to you... It's a little home cooking. Adventure. It's good stuff. Hey, could you give me some advice about other kinds of meat besides fish? He could. Ash. Yes to do? Why do you spend time with me? <laughs> because he likes you, friends, and everyone right? does. I just want to get to know you better. Is that so odd? It's very I'm straightforward, actually. So we know. <laughs> me. I came from a life of poverty. He was an actual I thief. Was lucky to even be let in here to study with all these high-class people. I think we have a lot in common. Being well, poor and being from Dusker are two different things. Yeah, <laughs> that's maybe not want to throw it like that. <laughs> we can still be friends, can't we? You are a peculiar No one's denying person. that. <laughs> sure, aren't we so all? I'm told. Oh, that one's actually really good in the later ones, too. Oh, all, all of the do's and ashes are great. Oh, man, we have so many more here. Because we got them all at once, because we've been sort of keeping everyone close together. To do an Annette! Ah, no! Oh, no, Annette, what have you blown up this time? Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no! Please tell me that wasn't the pan! I think it was the whole building, man. To do! Well, as you can see, the pan kind of exploded. Just a little. How did you manage that? <laughs> Many questions I have. And the pan just went boom. Ugh, I'm grateful nothing caught fire, but I don't know how, how nothing caught fire that? if it exploded. Are you hurt? Oh no, I just got a little spooked. <laughs> so did everybody. <laughs> really lucked out, didn't Probably the whole school is in an uproar at this worse. point. Indeed, but do not turn your back next time. Your life could depend on it. Right. So, I don't know how he always manages to I'll give advice while now. being like. So imposing about it. Let me help By accident, though, obviously, because it's just he doesn't know what he's saying. I will help you clean up. Right, he doesn't know. He doesn't know how he comes across. I guess. This is all my fault. You shouldn't have to help me. I have time. But he's offering. Let's fix this quickly. We will need to prepare. Might be rude to turn him down at that point. Arrive at the dining hall. And he's a really good cook. You're right. So. So after we clean up, you're also gonna help me cook. You. He loves doing it. Of course not. I'm just so sorry to bother you with this. <laughs> the glare. Oh, that's where it ends. Okay. I thought it was good. She was gonna be like, "Oh, why are you staring at me?" And he was just gonna be like, "Oh, no, it's nothing. I just, just surprised by that." Oh, Sylvia and Mercedes are also really good Mercedes. chains. 
You look divine as always. Are you off to pray? Way to way to go. That's where you go. You you get on the ladies as they're walking directly to the oh, altar to pray. Sylvain. I was just on my way to pray. How did you guess? Because you are always well, doing that. Because I've been watching your lovely. Oh, I get it. You're the type who's always looking at girls, aren't you? I well spotted. Lie. I do enjoy beholding women. What a good choice of words, and not weird at all. I know I sound like a dope. I just, I think you're special. Oh, I imagine how many people have heard that just today I'm from so him. Clumsy that I need someone to watch over me. <laughs> Is that why you can't take your eyes off me? Well, well played. And I mean that. You're. Uh, how can I put it without sounding even worse? You cannot. Okay, Please stop I trying. I want to get to know you better. As friends, I mean. Actually, that was really good. <laughs> well done. Well, what's something you like? Praying. Like pray. Bye. <laughs> since I was a child. You grew up in the Empire, didn't you? That's right. Oh I yeah, I forgot about Martellus. that. Martellus. But then all that really, really I bad stuff happened. House Martellus. It's a complicated story. I'm not sure that it's a very interesting. It is interesting. It's just really I sad. Share it with you. If it's too personal. Oh no, I don't mind. I wasn't trying to hide anything from you. I doubt she could. <laughs> She's just such an open book in some ways. Born. Oh. My father passed away while my mother was still pregnant with me. Oh no, it wasn't Martritz that had the the bad stuff happen. It was Bartels. My mother ended up marrying the head of House Bartels. That was the guy who was crazy. After, my mother bore a true Bartels child who bore a crest. She and I were treated as though we were no longer useful to the family after that. You think More classes some good. Just using her to secure a crest? Yeah, no doubt. Must have been. Why else would they my ditch her after? Were removed from the family and forced to flee to a churndom. I abandoned the Bartels name and took up our old family name again. So you grew up in a church. Okay, it makes more sense. I like this Sylvain. This Sylvain where he's actually just he he's drops the the disingenuity oh, for a minute and just, just takes you. genuine interest. Right. And I interrupted you. See you around Mercedes. I hope you do. See you. House Bartels wanted a crest and ruined other people's lives to get one. These idiots are all the same. They really are. There are so many of them who are just after the same thing, but don't let it get you and everyone's spirits down, because there are there are a few good ones out there. Oh man, I have personal sports with all these people. Damn! Well, we're going to be doing those next time, believe you me. Oh, this is a good run. We're going to be probably able to actually start next mission um, somewhere like halfway through next episode, the way things are looking now. This was a long one and made lots of mistakes here. One of the things I love about the, the different sports in this game is just how different you can see people acting around the other characters. Like, you'll, you'll have characters who are just, just completely different people around other people. Like, the way um, Annette talks to, to Dimitri for instance, and a lot of people talk to Dimitri is so different from how they would talk to the others. And very much the same way with um, Dudu and Dimitri plus uh, Hubert and Edelgard is very much the same way because there's this is incredible reverence blocking them out from having any, any, any kind of they, they, like they're very careful with what they say and everything, but at the same time, they're also more of who they are around those pre people. But then also, oh, it's just so great. Everyone's got masks and of different sizes and, and shapes. So I'm curious um, if uh, there's a character in any Fire Emblem game who has a, a proverbial mask, so to speak, that uh, that that is one of yours that you find most interesting. I just love the way they do Sylvain. I, I love Sylvain's because he's just he, he, like he, he. On the one hand, he really is that that goofy goof off like flirt type. But at the same time, there is like so much going on in there that drives that, and and that it comes from. And it's not all good. Like it's not just like I had a fun time flirting once time as a kid. That's what makes me a flirt. Like there's there's there are layers to it, and like there's some good, some bad, and and then like that all kind of contributes. And then you, you you sort of like by the time you've you've done like more analysis on him, the whole flirting with people thing is like not even part of him anymore. That's why he's one of my favorites. Anyways, um, so if any mask do tell. And next episode is going to be I don't know what because I'm recording this way in advance because I'm doing lots of three heads back to back because I'm an addict, I guess. <laughs> so without any more ado, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully I will see you around. Animals going to be out of here. I got to go to bed. It's late. Peace. Would you care for some assistance? And what would it cost me this time? You, I just wanted to, it's weird to point out that he's, he's got the other green circle around him. So I don't know why he's, he's not uh, with them technically, but learn quickly, my friend. Let's see, you're receiving my own royal assistance, so...